Hey, what's up guys? This is Jake with Hookah Daily and ShishaForum.com and in today's review we'll be reviewing Alfactor's chocolate flavor. As far as the cut on the Alfacker she ships, it's going to be your very traditional Alfacker cut, uh, larger cut. Uh, there are going to be a few tree trunk stems in there which are easy to pick out. It's going to be very brown in color. Um, they're uh, very juicy, very, very drippy. As you can see our bag is just soft and, and juices here. Sometimes in the right light, this, uh, which we don't have the right light here at all, but the, uh, the juices actually look a little on the red side, a little on the maroon side. But for the most part, it's a, it's a light brown color. As far as the smell, I mean, this stuff smells like an artificial chocolate. It, it doesn't smell like a, you know, a, a, a box of chocolates or like a Snickers bar or something like that. It has more of like an artificial uh, Tootsie Roll type chocolate smell to it. Almost like a chocolate, I don't know, air freshener or uh, the Axe Body Spray chocolate flavor or scent. Um, something like that minus the chemical smell. It's not a chemical smell at all, uh, but it's just a very, it's a very fake chocolate, a very artificial chocolate smell. But you definitely smell the chocolate. Um, again, it's not a real, real chocolate smell. It's not you don't get a whole lot of dairy type scent in there. Uh, it's, it has a sweet smell, but very nutty. As far as the taste, it tastes as much of the same. It, it tastes like a very mild artificial chocolate. Uh, again, nothing real sweet. You don't taste any morsels of Hershey's Kisses or Hershey's Bar or anything like that. It tastes more like a mild, like a Tootsie Roll type chocolate flavor. You know, just think a chocolate scented item, like if you've ever had the little markers when you were a kid, the little brown markers, and you and you smell the markers, they're all scented, the chocolate smelling one, or, you know, just something that's chocolate scented, but not necessarily real chocolate. Uh, very artificial uh, tasting. Not entirely sweet, it tastes like chocolate. It just depends on what kind of chocolate you're looking for. If you're looking for a real chocolate, this is definitely not going to be it. As far as the buzz, getting a little bit of buzz from it. Um, I kind of have a slight headache right now, so I'm not trying to really take a whole lot of big puffs on it. But the buzz is going to be definitely going to be there with Alfactor. Um, as far as the duration, I've been smoking this bowl for probably about 15 minutes now, and I can see the bowl going for probably another 25 uh, minutes before having to uh, go ahead and, and uh, clean it up. But if you're looking for a really good chocolate-like flavor, and you're looking for something that's more true to chocolate, definitely look for the Alfacker pipe, which we'll be reviewing. Um, next week for you guys. Alfacker pipe flavor. It's kind of misleading with the name. Alfacker pipe, you think of a you know a pipe or real tobacco tasting uh, shisha, whereas the, the Alfacker pipe is going to be more of like a, an Ovaltine or like a, a, a real chocolate flavor. Uh, very, very good stuff. But this is definitely not as good as the Alfacker pipe. So we're actually going to give the Alfacker chocolate a 5.5 out of 10. It's a middle of the road tobacco if you're looking for any chocolate flavors. This is definitely one of the better ones on the, on the market. So um, anyways, definitely pick it up if you're looking uh, for a chocolate-like flavor and you can't get the pipe or uh, you don't like any of the chocolates you've had before, Alfacker chocolate is a good, good choice for you. Definitely makes a good mixer. Try mixing with vanilla or graham cracker or something like that and be creative with it. It's a good mixing flavor, uh, not by itself. Until next time, guys, it's been Jake reviewing the Alfacker chocolate shisha, giving it a 5.5 out of 10. Until next time, you guys keep smoking.